Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. Are you excited to go on an adventure with us today? We'll create the dinosaur park diorama and learn about the carnivores, herbivores, plesiosaurs, and pterosaurs. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that like button for more great videos. Let's start with black foam board and fake grass. We'll add kinetic sand and spread it out. Using a white chalk marker, we'll draw the markings on the road. This road will divide our dinosaur park into two sections. Next, I have popsicle sticks, which I'll paint and glue together to make fencing. Ta-da! That was easy! This section will be for our herbivores. Now, I'll paint this plastic tray blue. This is where the prehistoric swimming reptiles called plesiosaurs will live. We'll also add some water and pebbles. I'll use this metal wire to create a cage where the pterosaurs will be. These are the prehistoric flying reptiles, so we don't want them to get away. Let's modify the fencing we made earlier with metal spikes. This will serve as the carnivore section. We'll add some rocks and plants. Now let's find our dinosaurs. Here's a dinosaur matchup game and puzzle. Ooh, let's put the puzzle together. Which dinosaur has such a long neck? Brachiosaurus. The Brachiosaurus is our first herbivore. They love to eat leaves and shoots off of tall trees. Let's color our next dinosaur. We'll make him red. with black details. Wow, what dinosaur is this? Diabolosaurus. Diabolosaurus has big horns to fight off predators. Let's find our next dinosaur. Oh, there it is. Let's add it in the water. Wow, it got so much bigger. You can always recognize a stegosaurus by its bony plates along its back. And that's our last herbivore in this section. Let's find our next dinosaur in this water wow book. Which dinosaur head is peeking through the water? Mosasaurus. The Mosasaurus was not a dinosaur at all, but a swimming reptile, which is now extinct. Let's play with this dinosaur's creativity kit. Looks like another water reptile. We'll color it different shades of blue and gray. Wow, it has a long neck and some sharp teeth. Elasmosaurus. The Elasmosaurus was a type of plesiosaur with a long neck. Good for sneaking up on its prey. Mm -hmm. 
let's try to find a dinosaur match with this memory game. Can you find the match? Yeah. Let's throw plotless. The Quetzal plotless was a pterosaur and the largest animal to ever fly. Wow, I found some dinosaur eggs. Let's open it up. Hmm, how many eggs are in here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Wow, twelve eggs. Let's choose this one. Is that a, a bird? Hmm, what is that? Pteranodon. <laughs> the pteranodon is another type of pterosaur. We'll set the mommy and daddy pteranodons on the ground and the babies up along the pterosaur cage. This guy fell off. Let's put him back up. I have a dinosaur stacking game. Let's open it up. And start stacking. I have a Stegosaurus, Triceratops, Spinosaurus, Brachiosaurus, Brontosaurus, Ankylosaurus, Pteranodon, Parasaurolophus, T-Rex, and what's this guy? Dilophosaurus. Although not a huge dinosaur, the Dilophosaurus was super speedy. What an alphabet puzzle. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. T-Rex. The mighty T-Rex was one of the largest and most dangerous carnivores. I wonder what's inside this surprise ball. Let's open it and find out. Looks like an activity sheet. Cool. And some stickers. Wow, what is that sticker? The Utahraptor is the largest raptor to have ever been found. Oh no, the Utahraptor escaped. A dinosaur truck to the rescue. Come on, fellow, we'll put you right back in. you all have fun learning about these types of dinosaurs with me? We learned about the swimming reptiles, the mighty carnivores, the flying pterosaurs, and the beautiful distinct herbivores. We hope you loved this video and can't wait to make more videos for you. Give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Bye!